here at Adventure Park USA. They had just opened like one minute ago. Already got someone on the course. But I've already got this credit. All I need is the hurricane. Funland, Fredericksburg. It was an earlier opening time at 10 a.m., but it was pretty quiet there. Kind of a ghost town, but there's really a lot of cars here, but with a noon opening, that might help. The last year, I saved a little money by putting a little extra on my card, knowing that I would probably be coming back this year to get the Wild West Express credit because it was closed when I was here last year. I still have $16 left on my card from last year. There are people on the train, so looks like we're good to go. Last year, I figured I would want two rides on this because I'd never ridden anything like this before, at least not that I was aware of. The Runaway Mountain is similar. But this particular hurricane is the only one that, is the only probably standalone one that this particular manufacturer has made. I did the one over at Western, Play, Western Playland in the El Paso area, Sunland Park, New Mexico. I did that one several times. So this won't be anything new at this point. And to think last year, I almost drove back here from Altoona, Pennsylvania. That would have been a very long detour along that coaster trip would have had to have given up a lot to come back and get it this was a much better way to get this credit it doesn't add much at all onto my drive to clementon from funland of fredericksburg i rode in the front and the back i'd say the back is definitely better it is way more intense in the back i was actually feeling dizzy at the end of it but also this jolt right here. You get a lateral jolt on that drop. Now clearly, the uh, Runaway Mountain at Six Flags Over Texas is better. It rides smoother, you get airtime on that drop. Here it was mostly just the uh, laterals. There might have been a pinch of airtime mixed in with it. But it's a good ride. It is quite intense though. These are more intense than your like galaxies or the kind of your regular Pinfaris that look like the galaxies. Now your Pinfari loopers or that style that that uh, doesn't have the loop. Those are going to be intense like this one. It took over a year, but I finally got all the credits here at Adventure Park USA. The Wild West Express, uh, which is their hurricane. Got the Schwarzkopf Wildcat. And there's a kitty coaster on the other side of that. Looks like there's a few field trip groups out here. Park hasn't been open for 30 minutes and the Wildcat already has a little bit of a line and they only, own, they only have this one car. I waited that out last time, but just really glad that this was open and I was able to get on it. Higher capacity ride, you don't have to wait as long for that. You can get right on. And if you're interested in some of the other rides, got like mini teacups, a little scrambler over there. Okay, I've got a mini golf course. The Tilt-A-Whirl. There were a couple of, uh, a couple of these uh, flat rides that were closed, I saw them say. Yeah, way off. Way off in the distance there is, be, below the slide is the kitty coaster. 